We want some good recruits. Get in there, go for the aggressive girls. I feel kind of sweaty and scared. It's just the coffee kicking in. Oh, you know what? Oh, I may have switched them. I put a little splash of bourbon in mine. The Boss is a new hilarious comedy directed by Ben Falcone, star Melissa McCarthy, bringing physical humor in a typical Melissa McCarthy fashion. This story is about the successful entrepreneur Michelle Darnell and her journey of trying to become a reformed woman after going to jail, set up by her former lover, Renault, played by Peter Dinklage, by using her former assistant Claire's, played by Christian Bale's daughter, to create a Girl Scout Lake group that sells Claire's brownies. Now, if you go into this movie expecting an Oscar-winning film, then yes, you'll be disappointed. This is one of those movies that you have to take it for what it is. A ridiculous, typical Melissa McCarthy comedy. No, they aren't sophisticated kind of jokes, the plot isn't a work of art, but it's just a fun movie to escape reality and laugh a whole lot. It started off very strong in its humor, got a little stiff and awkward at times toward the middle, I'll admit, but the ending climax is so ridiculous and hilarious, it's worth watching for the ending alone. It also had a very cute, heartfelt family message to it, which I very much appreciated. Peter Dinklage really stole the show for me, though. He was so over the top and held nothing back. I'm not looking for an intricate, never-before-seen plot in a comedy movie. I come to laugh my face off, and The Boss certainly delivers. If you want to have a good laugh, then The Boss is definitely worth the price of admission. From the Price of Admission team, thank you so much for watching.